here we are in the basement. Andrew's been making some additional renovations. In the meantime, while I had the recording pause, he built this beautiful glass. Blueberries, blueberries, uh, blueberries. <laughs> that. You found some blueberries, you can make blue dye. I did find some blueberries. Excellent! As you can see, we've been very productive. I'm still wearing the pumpkin suit. It, don't they, doesn't somebody wear a pumpkin costume on Community? I don't know. Doesn't Britta? Britta wears a squirrel costume. I don't remember if she was a pumpkin. I yet. feel like at one point she's dressed up like a pumpkin. Either way, I feel awesome in this pumpkin outfit. I feel like you just really want to dress like girls. Maybe you should have made a female character. You know what? I don't want to dress like girls. You do. Dress I am like destined girls. to dress like girls because that's all the outfits that I'm getting. When did the pumpkin become a girl's outfit? When this is a that, gender neutral outfit. When you said that Britta wore it, it became a girl's outfit. No, Britta's is a girl's outfit. I'm not Britta. I'm Gilliam. And I am a man. A man in high heels and a pumpkin outfit. A man, a pumpkin, an outfit. I am not afraid outfit. to flaunt my pumpkinness to the world. That's good. You'd be proud of your pumpkin. -ness. First, I was afraid. I was petrified. Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. I spent all so many nights thinking how you did me wrong. But I grew strong. And I learned how to get along. So now you're back from outer space. I just walk in to find you here with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed that stupid lock. I should have made you leave your key. If I'd have known for just one second you'd be back to bother me. Boy, now go. Walk out the door. Just turn around now. You're not welcome anymore. Okay. Weren't you the one who tried to break me with goodbye? Did you think I'd crumble, Ryan? Did you think I'd lay down and die? I'm gonna die. I will survive, oh, as long as I have my pumpkin suits, I know I'll stay alive. I've got all my life to live, and I've got all my love to give, and I'll survive. I will survive. Hey, hey. That's it took all the strength I had not to fall apart. <laughs> I didn't know you do that much of that I know song. the whole song. They play it at work at least once a week during my shift. I know pretty much every word. Ooh. Look at this jack-o'-lantern. It's flickering. It looks kind of horrifying. It looks awesome is what you mean. You chopped a hole in my brethren and stuck a candle inside of him, and I'm supposed to think that's fun? I'm supposed to say, oh, how cute. No, that's horrible. You're horrible. Ooh, I need to have a pumpkin. I need to have in other news, to this costume door. looks much better when it's not in full orange mode, despite my previous assertions that the orangeness was awesome. I retract all of those assertions. The high heels, however, look great in teal. I'm gonna switch back to the pumpkin pants now. I, feel I have no idea why I'm making this secondary room other than the fact I wanted to have a pumpkin door. You know, that is a legitimate reason. That door looks like a big old squash. Just like a giant gourd. I like it. I approve. I don't approve this pumpkin. He's shimmering and it's freaking me out. Making me nervous. You don't like my jack-o'-lantern? It looks like he's about to break free and curse us all. Of course, the pumpkin in the ceiling with the candle and its screaming maw is also... Hey, the face is different every time you put it down. It is? is I think so. That time? I think it was angry last time. Now it's happy. Happy is good. It still looks like a ghost is going to come out and haunt us, but it's going to be like a clown ghost that's laughing and throwing like cream pies. That's, that's more, okay. That's more terrifying than no, a regular not ghost. A clown, not a clown ghost with like weird face paint and stuff, just like a ghost that wants you to laugh and isn't angry. Look at my nice beautiful ghost. little garden I made. I'm over by the memorial fountain. Oh, the memorial fountain. I like the memorial fountain. Alright, we need we a did, goal. We need a good thing there. Enough aimless wandering. We need to pick a thing to do and we need to get it done. I pick a thing to do. It was make a basement and a greenhouse. You did that when we weren't even watching. They didn't even get to see the home improvement, which is fine. Well, home will... improvement is so Wait. boring. I am making. Whoa, 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 whoa! That was weird. Oh wow! Look, he's putting together walls. We are all just on the edge of our seat, wondering how this is going to turn out. What a caper! 
what a completely wonderful moment in the life of Steven Stevenson. Hats off. Hats, literally, hats off to you. And a different hat on, because I have multiple hats. Alright, I'm thinking that digging might be a mistake if we dig in the wrong direction. I say we go explore those ice caves again. What do you think? What do you think? The ice caves have so many riches. If we go back there, yeah, who knows what we could find? We could find death again. Let's make it happen, though. We found death once. We can deal with it. I'm just in a mood to go into an ice cave dressed as a pumpkin and knock some crap over, man. Let's start some stuff. Let's do things. All right. Yeah, I like your attitude. I am a get-up-and-go kind of a pumpkin is what I am. Okay, I just gotta finish I am putting one, all my stuff back. I'm a spunky Spelunkin pumpkin! Spelunkin pumpkin! I have found a new superhero identity and I'm never taking this suit off. I don't care how many times you tell me that it needs to be washed. Mom, I'm wearing this pumpkin suit until the day that I die and you can pry it off my cold, dead corpse. I am the Spelunkin pumpkin. Wow. Sorry. Some, uh... Some issues might have leaked into that rant a little bit. Ooh! Should I have blue goggles or yellow goggles? I really like the yellow goggles, dude. I am not gonna lie. Those are Oh, really I can cool. have blue pants. I just need to find red dye and I can be Spider-Man. I'm so jealous of your yellow goggles. I just want to cry. But then I remember that I'm this Spelunkin pumpkin and I am alright again. Alright, so we're heading to Ice Caves. Yeah, it's time to Spelunk. Spelunkin with the Pumpkin Brothers. Super Pumpkin Brothers. Super pumpkin. You're wearing pumpkin armor, and I am wearing a giant puffy pumpkin mascot suit. And yet, I am still ostensibly the cooler one. Except I have the goggles, remember? But I'm in the ice world, so cool. Yes, I'm in the ice world. I'm literally cooler than you, because I'm deeper underground in the ice world. As you can see, scenic the Iceland is a serene, don't calm place. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think anybody heard that. But that was a really great impromptu arrested development moment, and I'm a sucker for those. Oh, oh wow. I almost fell to my death. Fortunately, almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Or bombs, when you almost killed yourself. Yeah, bombs. but then you died instead. When you stepped on that pressure plate. That was a great I wasn't moment. talking about that. I will always be talking about that. I will probably never stop talking about that, because that was my favorite moment. Your favorite moment was when I died. Bambi, Bambi the party girl! Bambi the party girl?! What? Is she gonna move into your pumpkin basement? She better. That'd be legit. She's the girl for me. Her name is Bambi the Party Girl and she lives in a pumpkin basement. And I am a pumpkin. This is like destiny. It's like... You can come over to my pumpkin basement and visit her whenever you want. Well, I'm going to. Like, fate gave you Caitlyn to comfort you after Holly's loss. And now fate has given me a sidekick in my pumpkin escapades. Thanks, fate. It's a nice guy sometimes. I almost want to go back upstairs right now and say hi to Bambi, but I am busy exploring in this ice cave with my fast boomerang and fortune waits for no man. Hey, I found the place where I died before. I have located it. Bambi will understand. Bambi understands that I'm an adventuring man. She knows that this Belunkin pumpkin's got to do some serious digging. Got to bring home the bacon. If I don't Spelunk, there's no food on the table. That's what I always say. I said that once. I wish it could rhyme, but I'm not that clever. I'm working on it. But not a lot rhymes with spelunk. Like what? Chunk? Lunk? Spunk? Dunk? I bet they have lots of spunk. Oh, hunk. There's a good one. Do you spelunk and hunk? I'm the spelunk and punkin. If I don't spelunk, then I'm not a hunk. Except that's not true. I'm always a hunk. Hunk a bird in love. No! Oh no! Okay, I'm alright. Spelunk, then what am I? Exactly! If I am not the Spelunkin pumpkin, then what am I? Okay? You're definitely not the Boner Jam. That is a fact. <laughs> that is absolutely a fact. And I'm a little uncomfortable that you brought that up in Snowland over here. <laughs> Fans of The Office will understand. If you don't know what we're talking about, I, I recommend just. Just ignore it. Just let it just go. Just move on with your life. It's you don't you don't need to know. It's not it's not a big deal. We're just silently judging you. Although you really ought to watch that show sometime. It is really funny. I found some gold ore. Lucky. 
found Riches Untold, baby. And some tin, which I'm going to purposefully leave behind for you. Because I know how much you love tin. Is that my sympathy prize? It's tin. It is literally not even a prize, and there's no sympathy. I just am leaving it behind. I was forced to dig a couple because I wanted to get through. But the rest of it is staying. Yeah, there. well, I found some topaz, so the joke's not What? Whoa, 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 whoa. I have topaz. How much did you find? Like two. Oh, uh, okay, because I was going to say, if you found like ten, we're talking. Grab like a time. But you did not find like 10, you found like nothing. You found a worthless number of worthless things. Yeah, well, at least I have a um, pumpkin yeah. suit. I have a pumpkin suit. That I gave you. Yeah, so you don't have it anymore. I'm throwing rope at monsters and it's really not effective. You'd think it would be great, but it's not at all. Yo, back off me. Hey, hey, these caves are getting interesting down here. You gotta get down here, man. I'm on my way. Do you see me on your locator? Oh, you're not on your way to me anymore. You might think you are, but I am in mysterious and inscrutable lands now. I am digging down deep through the ice caverns. And I am discovering just some crazy stuff. Mostly, I'm actually just discovering more ice. But you would know that if you were here. I'm coming, sort of. You're still 177 feet away in the wrong direction, dude. I'm working on it. It's pretty hard to find me. I'm down in, like, a giant labyrinth of just caves. I can make snowballs. I also injured myself somehow by standing on top of slush. So things are not going too well for me. Snowballs are ammo. Okay. What? Can you throw them? Try it, try it, try it. Throw yeah, some snowballs at some busy. dudes. Busy throwing snowballs, that's the only excuse I'll accept. I found some water, so that's great, because oh, I, I can, can drown again I can if throw I want snowballs. to. Ouch. Oh no, there's a lot of ice signs over here. There's a lot of water over here. I'm drowning again. You're 70% water, you can still drown. On the next, Super Terraria Brothers. Oh, the brothers yet. encounter a there's new enemy. What kind of a monster is that? It's an undead viking. Cool! There are vikings? Undead ones. You know it's really exploring when there are vikings and they're undead. And Andrew turns into an Italian. I found a something over here. You found a something? I what a a something. is it, Luigi?